Hello guys, welcome back. Today I've got a really cool little alternating current. Um, if you follow Cube Hamster, you'll know he did one uh, a couple of weeks ago. However, this one's uh, a little bit smaller, so I thought I'd just show it to you. So as you can see, the current just fluctuates between uh, full strength and zero. Well, it actually only goes to 14, and you'll see why in a moment. So I just thought before... Um, before I do anything, I'll just show you. Thought I'd demonstrate basically how this works, and the easiest way to do that is just to show you the two main um, two main reasons why it works. So this one on the left just goes to um, full, and then slowly decays from that, and this one starts from zero and slowly goes upwards from that. So in this one, if you just look at the first uh, the first uh, two by three area nearest to me, you can see that basically what happens is a signal goes in here comes through like this and then goes down and then because it's using the comparators when there's two redstone in a row it will lose one signal strength so it will start at 15 and then go around and then it, when it comes to here it will go down to 14 and then it will go around again 13 and then it will keep on going around again until it gets to zero and then that's just what this is for this is just a reset so when it gets to zero this redstone torch will turn on giving it a little signal so that's basically um, the main concept here However, to get it to go up and down, I made this, this little half of it. So this one just goes up slowly. And what's happening is it's using the um, the negative, uh, the subtracting feature on the comparators. So the signal comes in and it will um, slowly decrease, like decay. And because this one's always on 15, this one will always be 15 minus whatever's coming in here. So it will start off as 15 minus 13 because there's, um, I mean, 15 minus 14 even. So that will give a one signal strength, and that's because this is just coming here. And then because this is using the loop that's um, over there, this will slowly go down. So this one, this one will always stay as 15. However, uh, this one will go um, 14, and then go around, and then 13, and then go around, and then go, um, go all the way down. So that will make this current go um, up from 1, 2, 3, because it will be 15 minus 14, 15 minus 13. And so on until it gets all the way down, um, all the way up to um, 15 or 14 in this case. And then once it's done that, this will just turn off, which will mean that this um, it will just reset. And that leads me on to here, which I just put the two together as best as possible and compacted it as much as possible. So this is actually exactly the same as that one next to it, except there is another decaying thing in here. Because as you can see, this thing just gets to the top and then instantly goes down. Whereas if but I put in another one of these, just around this, so it goes like this. So this will be on, initially be on um, going up from 1, 2, 3, counting up. But then, once it's full, it will this will all be turned off. However, there will still be 15 in this little circuit here. So this circuit will then decrease from 15 down. So as you can see, it goes 15 and then it will just, once this is all off, it will go... 14, 13, 12, and that is what it is doing on the way down. I mean, I hope that ex um, explains it well, because, I mean, it's quite a, hard, quite a hard concept to grasp, so I hope that actually clears things up for people who are wondering. And then, obviously, as this ends, as this stops, it will send a pulse in here and start the whole thing again, which keeps it as an alternating current, as you can see. So to build it, you're just going to want to pause it here and then just follow it, because it's only... Um, one deep as you can see so it's all on this layer here and it's um, quite easy to build and then so if you want to know what materials to bring they're in my hotbar now with the things on the right just being the um, redstone lamps and the redstone for here for this for this line and one important note when building it is just to make sure that this is on subtract mode because as you'll see if it's not on subtract mode it will just do it will go all the way down but then it will just instantly go up. So you want to make sure this is on decay um, on subtract mode. If you want to build either of the other two, so the one that just goes um, instantly full and then decays down, then you can just stop and pause it here. And the same for this. So you can just pause it here for the one that just goes all the way up slowly and then instantly goes down. So I know this isn't completely groundbreaking stuff as far as we are aware, because there aren't really any immediate uses, but I've Pretty sure you can find something useful, if not just for lighting, to be honest. So thank you guys for watching, and I hope to see you next time.